The 20th century was powered by polluting fossil fuels, big coal, oil and gas, that came at a huge environmental and health cost. But we knew there was a better way. Clean energy creates good jobs and grows our economy, protects our air and water, and gives our climate a fighting chance. The good news is we're reaching that tipping point where solar and wind are cheaper than dirty fuels. It's happening all across the country. When one family starts saving money with solar panels, neighbors notice and it multiplies from there. Solar panel costs have dropped over 80% in five years. In 2013 alone, the solar industry grew 20% and created 24,000 good new jobs. We're tipping the balance with every coal plant that gets retired and is replaced with newer, cleaner technology. Texas is just one example of where solar power is cheaper than gas and coal. Another is Colorado's largest utility adding more solar because it's cheaper. And U.S. wind capacity has tripled in the last six years. That means wind turbine manufacturing is busier than ever and creating good American jobs. Already, Iowa and South Dakota get a quarter of their electricity from wind. So clean energy isn't just the right thing to do. With savings to producers and consumers, it's increasingly the cost-effective thing to do. Even Wall Street can read the signs, with solar stocks doubling in the past year. And the majority of voters agree, we should invest in clean energy. With every clean energy victory, with every fossil fuel we leave in the ground, we are closer to having 100% clean energy, closer to cleaner air and water, and a chance to slow climate disruption. When we free ourselves of dirty fossil fuels, we are never going back. Let's go 100% clean energy now.